Hello Electroheads, today we have with us the VW ID3 Tour Pro Plus, which has a range of up to 340 miles. And this is sold as the car for maybe the younger families. Well, we thought, well, we should probably put it to the test today and take a trip to the beach. And obviously we haven't got kids, they're too young for that, but we do have um, some more adult children. All right. Uh, hi, Rich. Ready, ready to go? Yeah, you look like you're dressed appropriately yeah. for our day out today. I am, yeah. I've got my beach towel, I've got my bodyboard. Uh, I'm ready to go. Well, should we just go get some fish and chips and just have a great day out? Yeah, let's do it. Which beach are we going to? Margate. Sounds good. Yeah, yeah let's I've go Margate. Let's yeah, go. cool. All right, let's do nice it. One. Right, kids, so what are we going to do today? What would you like to do at the beach? Uh, I want to go bodyboarding. Okay. Cole? Yep. What would you like to do today? Fish and chips, uh, two-piece lots, and I want to throw someone in the water. Two-piece okay. lots? Two-piece lots, mate. Do you not know what two-piece lots two, are? I know what two... You know those machines? Two-piece machines. Yeah, man. Yeah. We, you, you can get, like... You can win, like, 10p. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's oh, so, 10 It's so exciting when they all drop. Yeah. Um, I know what you mean. And who do you think is going to be giving you this pocket money? Uh, you? you. I, Your I mom, mean, right? These are the characters for today, right? You're like the parent, <laughs> single parent. No one wants to be with you. Uh, <laughs> oh my God, two piece lots, mate. One thing I just wanted to start. It's, it's quite warm. Like Ailish, you're moaning about being warm. Moaning's you're a wearing, strong word. You're wearing a literal swimsuit. So, right, we've got 240 miles of range left on a journey that's probably going to be between 150 and 200 miles. This is a really good test of this as a young person's, as a young family, sorry, car. If you've got kids moaning about being hot in the back, you're on a long journey. You want to get the AC on and shut them up, but that's going to take miles off your range. Do we make that call? Good question. Well, as mum, I'm going to say absolutely yes, because I need to be in prime condition to get us to the beach safely and soundly, so we need to get this cool. aircon on. All right, I'm on board with that. Let's do it. Um, Paul? I, I genuinely think we should not use the AC. Interesting. Like, if we don't make it to Margate and back, I don't have the patience to charge an electric car. <laughs> well, it takes like 20 minutes to get That's the charge too, into too this long. Car. No. Okay, okay, I'm, Sorry, I'm, I'm going to climb it. It's two to Sorry. one. It's two to one. Yeah. Right, everyone close your windows. So we're in Blackheath now, one of the nicer areas of London. We are, yeah, we're going to be leaving for Margate. For our American viewers, I would describe Margate as the New Jersey of the UK. It's to London what New Jersey is to New York. It's a very, very good coverage. Thank you. We need to make this, you know, worldwide accessible. How, yeah, exactly. How long is this journey, by the way? So, what do we have? An hour and 23, it says on the clock here. So, keeping kids entertained is quite hard. Yeah. We've got literally no entertainment here in the back, do we? What's your first impressions of this car as a passenger car? Oh, it's like your classic, comfortable, basic family car that just does the job with ease. I quite like the fact that it's got quite a lot of range. It can do 340 miles of range. 340? Yeah. yeah. Well, over 300? Is that claimed yeah. or actual? That's WLTP. WLTP, okay. So probably you're looking at 300 in reality. Okay, no, that's that's decent. I don't think my car can even do 300. Good. Not with you driving. No. <laughs> right, DJ, play me some tracks. I think he's busy. Do you want to DJ for me? Yeah, I can DJ. We're on the motorway now as well. The great British motorway. Just going to get some shots of this because it's just so beautiful. It's, it's pretty great. Concrete bridges. We've right. got golf TDIs. We've got whatever that is. <laughs> We've got a Nissan Leaf. Oh, EVs all the way, bro. I'm dizzy. Okay. I'm going to try and sort out the tunes. Um, oh, God. Hold on, mate. Cop tunes are going to be on. Alish's phone. Yeah. I can just connect my Bluetooth, can I? Oh, please. Okay, this isn't very easy, is it? One thing I want to point out, which is really, really great about the driver's seat in particular, is the lovely armrest that we have got going on here. It is that perfect parent's rest. Well, we've got one here. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. Cole, if you just move. Well, yeah, sure. Yeah, we've got a couple of cup holders as well. Oh, it's, it is lovely. I'm very comfortable with this car. I don't know how I feel about this car. Tell you, me more. You <laughs> you Cole, Cole, I will turn this car around. Come so what I was saying is, one of the things that I don't like about this car is that there's not much headroom. Definitely not enough room to swing a crocodile. <laughs> Is that a term of phrase? Because that actually sounds like one. Swing a cat. Swing a cat is the phrase, obviously. There's some little things, right? Like, uh, I, I've said this in one of my other recent videos, but BMW 3 Series, I know it's not electric, but it's kind of the gold standard for just a good 
affordable-ish saloon. 35 grand that car is, right? You have individual climate control for both passengers in the back. Me and Cole have nothing back here except for some USB-C charging ports, which like nobody uses. I, I, to be honest, like as a videographer, I rate that. Yeah, because there's a lot of videographers sitting in the back of ID3s. You're the one honest. holding the camera, so I don't know why you're complaining. I, my I mean, my, my biggest problem with it is, is headroom. Yeah, the headroom isn't that much. Yeah. And you're tiny, aren't you? You're like... Yeah, like my head's right up a... It's, it's, it's pretty good in the front here. Like I've, yeah. I've got the headroom. Like I'm five foot ten. It's not too bad. Like the seat's very comfortable. It's a nice big windscreen. So you know it's, it's all nice and light and airy up up in the front here. But the aircon is really bad. Yeah, I can't feel any of it it's back really here. Really bad. Like I'm. I don't know about you guys. I'm. I'm really hot still. Like, yeah, I'm it, quite It's not hot. cool, and we're on the coldest setting right mm. now. This car on the road is about thirty-eight thousand pounds. I think electric cars have to do a job of stealing people away from similarly priced petrol or diesel cars. And right now, if I had to buy a family car and I wasn't necessarily already sold on electric cars, obviously I am. But if I wasn't, I would be tempted to just go for something like a BMW 3 Series over this because it's a similar price and I think you get more bang for your buck. Oh my goodness. Is this really gonna happen for the whole journey? Right, how do I turn on the uh, one pedal drive? Don't know, mate. Don't know, mate. What you usually have is a button, but in this car, they seem to hate buttons. The infotainment, it just completely baffles me. It's not very accessible. Um... Ow! <laughs> I reckon you press the big blue button, and then... Uh, vehicle, vehicle, surely. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no. Driver assist? No. Apparently there's a, some coffee on the side of the road. Didn't need to know that. Help! <laughs> help! I need somebody, help! help. Just, not just anybody, help! Help! Oh, I have an idea. We have room for one more passenger. Ooh, yes! Well, basically, it's gonna be the dad, isn't it? It's like Elish's husband. Sorry, is, is that all I can get? The best I can get? <laughs> yeah, I Fucking think we're... a green reptile. Yeah, and it's gonna be from like Florida or something. So I think we call him like Dwayne. Dwayne! Dwayne, yeah. yes. Or Chad. Dwayne. Dwayne. Okay, Dwayne. Dwayne. How's, how's the drive, Elish? I have to say, the, the thing about the ID3 is it just you just don't feel very connected to the car which do you know what I mean when, when I say that like when when you're driving it's all a bit like loose I'm not really putting my foot down on the pedal much like whereas with the Honda e, I, I feel like you have a bit more of a connection when you're actually driving yeah. and also the, the similar sized car to the Honda e, so it's a good comparison yeah similar size but it, the thing is it does make I just feel very light when you're driving it. The thing is, like, this absolutely spanks the Honda E when it comes to usability as a family car because yeah. it actually has usable real world range. This has a lot more room as well, doesn't it? Yeah, this feels roomier, yeah. yeah. The Honda E, I definitely, like, I find it a, a bit of a better drive than the ID3. I think the Honda E is definitely more fun. Yeah. It feels far more responsive. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is a great car. I think actually, I don't really need to think about much when I'm driving this car. Yeah. Probably what you want when you've got a lot going on. There's a bloody block crocodile being pushed into the front, two kids being animals in the back. Um, I've, I've been handling this situation no problem. Yeah, I think you've been handling it very well. Thank you. Thank and, you. and so, and also, if you're making a car for the masses, you don't necessarily want it to be like a super responsive driver's car because that's not what everybody wants. Most people just want effectively a go car drive. Have you tried it in sport mode? No, actually. We should do that, shouldn't we? Let's get Cole filming how difficult it is for okay. you to yeah. do that, because you and infotainment systems don't necessarily mix that well, do you? Um, not this one, Rich. Okay. No. Um, I've had better infotainment. Is the aircon actually on? No, no I, I think we switched the aircon off because it just wasn't doing anything. Oh, wait, AC is off. Click on AC. That's why. Where is it? Top right. On the right. That's why. There we go. Okay. Ailish has been moaning about the AC for about the last 35 minutes. It turns out she just didn't switch the AC on. Oh, the... look at that cold air coming. Oh, that feels I better already. a lot going on right now. What okay. would you do without okay. coal? Right. So, I'm getting us safely to the beach. So, yeah, let's try and get sport mode on. Yes, okay. Denied. No. Also, can we just bear it? Oh, here we go, mode. Too See, bad. a physical button helped you out there. Sport. Um, I mean... Nothing's really changed right now. You wouldn't necessarily notice it massively on the way to no, would you? I mean, we're just, we're just in cruise control right now. The range right has gone down. Oh god, yeah, 189. That's fine, just, we've, got, we've got loads of time. We're, we're, we're fine. We can do like two trips to Margate with this. Oh it's, yeah. It's all good. 
Yeah, 188 miles right now. Right, guys, I think I think we need to play a game. So I've got I have a good game of playing cars. It's just oh, called the I Alphabet like Game. So we come up with any topic. It could be like Ailish's shoe collection. <laughs> it could be uh, cars. It could be uh, like the back catalogue of Burt Bacharach. So I would start, and I'd start with the letter A, and I have to name something in that subject beginning with that letter. You'll be Ailish C, and we just keep going through the alphabet. I'm going to be so bad at this. If we do cars... <laughs> Let's, okay, why, why not? Okay, alright. So, so, who starts? I start with okay. A, okay. and I'm going to start with a bath. Uh, Bentley. C, Citroen. Nice. D, I'm going to go for Dacia, Dacia. Duster. Of course it's the Dacia. The double D. Check out my Dacia video above, guys. I'm going to go for a... Oh, it's... Um, no. E. No, no, I know it's E. <laughs> like, E type. Oh, God. That was easy. Wait, I need to get another one. Wait, E. Um. Seasons change, time passes by. As the weeks become, the months become the years. E Tron! Right, we made it. We made it. This ID3 got us all the way. Guys. Yeah. Wrong car. Oh what? Car. Okay, sorry. Hang on. This is our ID3. Right, take two. Ailish, we've made it. These cars are just so popular now; they're everywhere. There's like three in this car park. I know. It's and amazing. it got us. <laughs> Oh, how was the car? Uh, it was absolutely fine to drive. I would recommend it for uh, for a single mum taking two naughty children in the back. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, how were we? How annoying was it? As uh, said? Yeah, you guys were. Um, Let's be honest. It was rich. Was really annoying. Uh, you were the worst, Cole. Oh, actually, Cole's, thank you. Cole's always the worst. But... To to kind of calm Cole down a bit, I think we need to get some food. It's a and lovely day, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. Let's just sit so, on the beach and eat. Yeah, let's get some food. Let's go to the beach and eat, and then let's think about getting our swimmers on and getting in. Excited. Let's do it. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. <laughs> yep, I'm riding a crocodile. Final verdict, the ID3. It has got an SMR gate. We have loads of charge left. It wasn't even fully charged when we left. Loads of space in the boot. We've left loads of stuff in the car. Cole got changed in there. It's just, it's a great family car. I agree. It was a pleasant ride, smooth ride. Ailish did a great job getting us here. Well, I think the real test is going to be when we're all soaking wet and it's raining, which is definitely going to happen. And we've got to go back to London, but we'll worry about that after this. It's fine, yeah. I think we'll just blast the heating on when we get in. Yeah. Dry off. But first, let's have a little splash. Let's go for splash. Make sure to like and subscribe. See you later.